Hi, welcome back. Professionals and students and friends. We're in configuration eighth table in this series. So we'd like to close we're in configuration yesterday itself till seventh. But here I would like to tell about tables. It is very, very important for functional consultants if they would like to drive any solution. Okay. So now let's get into the topic without wasting any further time. Yesterday we have taken iPhone 15 and we have taken few specification. So all these are pre-assumed specification. Don't compare with your real time uh, live iPhone configuration, okay? But something we should require to learn something interesting, to map what you learn with our day-to-day -day life, okay? SAP is one of the best software which actually help you out like uh, to drive the solution for your customers in day-to-day -day activities whether it is go for any module material management production planning our sales and distribution is pure live it's with you every day okay so this is what i would like to discuss okay characteristics characteristic values are stored in this table IBSY, IBSYMBOL. Okay, let's go check in SAP system SC16N. Okay, so let's look at this table. Okay, so this is the table actually only when you link CT04 transaction, when you try to create a CT04 transaction and then you try to link with your uh, characteristic will with characteristic values. That means you derive your characteristic values from characteristics. If you don't have characteristic, you cannot be able to derive the values. That's what I'm saying. So let's go to CT04. So probably someone might not seen my previous videos so directly jumping into uh, you know, for table learning, for those people it required. I have defined these characteristics in my pre previous video. So this is one of that stories. And let's come here. So let's give this internal characteristic. So ATINN, need not remember all these things. Even you don't remember this table, but in real time, if you'd like to pull some logic, okay, you should know the tables. That's why I'm just putting my effort Okay, if you see this here, you can able to see the characteristic against that particular value. Let me try to enter one more value. So, so like this, I'm just giving example. Yesterday, I have defined a few characteristics around five to six. So now you can able to see this. Let me try to do this here. Close this one. Let's select this. Let's try to put here. Now see this iPhone color. I have defined red, green. All these are the values and this is your characteristics. So in the similar way, storage 256 GB and 125 GB. Okay. Okay. So before getting into the further discussion, okay. So I would like to tell one thing. So this is from, so I'm currently holding 4,000 plus students, okay? So if you look at here, this is SAP SD sales and distribution. If you're really serious enough to handle the things on your own, you better try this course and uh, on SAP SD, okay? And if you'd like to get into the S4 HANA series, because after 2027, or else to impress an interview board, you should require some minimum knowledge. You don't spend thousands of rupees, if I said so, like, you know, giving thousands of rupees for external consultants. No one is perfect in now in S4 HANA, I'm telling you. So take a training system, I'm telling you, and you try this one, business partners, so that, you know, you'll come to know this one. In this, apart from the few other courses also there, like creating Metal Master and running your OTC, okay? So hardly, we have 10% changes in S4 HANA, even if it is a powerful platform for future. You try this course and along with this, 
uh, if you want to try inter company sales and sd business processes also there if you really interested in pricing i have few courses like sd complete pricing concept okay and this is completely almost 99% recorded and as for ana pricing screens you can try this okay so few other set of courses if you already trying better try this course 100% getting master to write functional specification it is very very important i am telling you i keep on telling in my youtube forum and other other places also the students who are learning from me from me so like getting master to write functional specification okay this is very very important how to gather the business requirement how you can able to convert the your requirement into functional specification the specification writing has its own importance and preparing business documents it will give an edge you will be comfortable in real time at the time of working at the same time at the same time if you don't have a time your work is driven from your lead or manager so then it will make easier if you do this course okay and apart from that certainly 99% of the projects for sdn and mumu consultants and uh, any other consultants okay you required idocs here i explained five scenarios initially i configured three scenarios after the two more scenarios i have added so like you know purchase order creation with outbound inbound purchase order how it will be converted into the sales order and uh, your delivery and your billing all those scenarios i have added apart from that additionals okay stvs if you want to learn you can try so this is my courses i'm just providing these links below of this video okay so let's get into the topic now again so cukn what is this table let's check this one okay let's come here cukn this is the table okay so this is for dependent dependency storage variance how you defined okay let's go to the next screen you can see this this is the place where you have defined all these dependencies okay so you can take let's take this uh, dependency okay let me show you so if you would like to drive any logic you can able to drive on your own okay i think it seems to be the change number let's put here so not this one okay let's come here so let's execute okay so block dependency source code base just press enter and give this okay it's not filtering like this let me check so let's go to the bottom of the screen we can able to find our values if any minor see you can able to see this okay you have to give that value actually okay it starts with uh, the series and uh, what are the logic suppose for price calculation in variant yesterday we have given right self dot g dot price for all these we have defined a price actually so probably you can uh, watch uh, other videos and uh, probably like you know at last i can able to show you the cycle actually so 125 gb okay 256 gb and we have defined the prices and all these are the your dependencies dependencies like your precondition or else uh like um, procedure and other two conditions also will be there action and all so that you can see in this table a057 it is surprising why you are talking about this table so this is standard table if someone has uh, generally uh 50 to 50 to 60% they will use existing solution so a057 if you look at here okay sorry a057 if you look at here so like uh, we have all the condition regards what you have created okay uh probably you can able to find our variance also okay let me try to check it's with so material let's do one thing let me take the material slash o mm03 
So let's give the material check how extent it works. We can give sales organization also no issues. Yesterday we have created uh, for this main material, all these are the variants. Like, you know, if colors at the time of creating sales order, you have, you will choose all those things, right? That, that relevant pricing table, a star tables are your pricing tables, right? So if you define your own table, A0, 156, A0, 167, like that, you will have a tables, okay? So now you got it, some idea about uh, if, if it is pricing relevant logic, it's supposed to be driven from where we have to do this, okay? So characteristic table, C, A, B, and T, okay? Let's check this. C, A, B, and T. Okay. So internal character, you can take this one. You can able to find, right? Suppose the same characteristic, if it is available, some hundred languages and description is various. So you would like to drive some logic, then you can able to do this one. Okay. You need not remember all these tables telling my friend. You just make a habit of uh, using these tables for your fingers. So if you would like to, if you wanted to, really wanted to remember SMP tables, then you will have thousands of tables. You will become mad. Don't try to do that. You can Google it or else you can make a note it down somewhere. This is how you can help yourself. CAW1. Okay. What is this CAW1? CAWN. So now see this, again, you give one characteristic here. Okay, now you can able to see this, valid from and valid to and counter how many characteristic values also there. This is internal, this is also one table, but you have other uh, uh, values also available. If I click here, okay, probably you can find anything which is useful for your logic. But I have seen most of the times code also they have used this table, CAWN. So let's go to CAWNT, okay? So let's try to do this. So previous table, you don't find text, but you can able to find the text here, see? 125 GB storage. Previously only value got it. Now this is storage. Now let's get back to the slide again. So AUSP, and uh, you know you can able to see cu cuta cu table info this is important again this is for analysis so let me show you cu table info uh -huh. it came wrong let me check cu Table info. Oh, sorry, I forgot. And this is transaction. I'm extremely sorry. So this is not table. Okay. See you table info. This is very very important transaction. It's not table, but still, uh, why why I need to do separate video so that you know. See you table info. You can able to give your sales document an item. You can able to find the details of. Uh, uh, your variant and uh, your transaction. I'll show you this one. This is a big broader table and uh, let me try to create one order. <clears throat> so let's get into the our variant configuration table. Let's click here. Okay. So let's choose this iPhone Pro. No problem. Let's choose the storage, 256 GB. Let's choose the colors allowed. Let's choose red, my favorite color. And speed of iPhone, so 4 GB, sufficient. So based on that price will be calculated. So accessor is what you would like to give. So you can uh, select all. So charging pin and cable we are giving. Okay, let's save this. Okay, now go to, let me show you the price also. Probably we'll have I have shown you in one of my video, but still I'm showing you. So like, you know, for your understanding, if you see the conditions, all these are the values you got it. Okay. So what is the order number? 20358. Okay.
so you might have multiple variants and multiple materials right okay let's copy this let's run this so now you will get all details okay it is little broader table right your object number and you can able to see external id and uh, from where is valid from and valid to okay so this transaction also some extent it is useful to check the details at the transactional level okay now you can see this one piece unit all these things okay so that's fine i think you can able to explore this one on your own okay suppose the same material is there you know five six plants in the same cell order generally it won't be there then you can give the plant filter or else if you take the plant filter based on that orders also you can able to get it for example i n uh, 61 i am just taking this plant let's execute this okay so this nothing is coming okay because we didn't set up any configuration plant specific right so that's why it is coming so better choose this with sales order and uh, you just try to run and you try to check this okay only my request if you are not yet subscribed please subscribe my channel all these are the different set of udemy courses if you'd like to learn transportation basics also you can try this and this is a course for idox i'm telling you 100% if you don't need no problem please subscribe my channel and try to give some comments and try to move my channel little further so that you know it will be helpful for others when you share the knowledge your iq will increase and i'll get a lot of blessings from others okay i think for tables also it's a long discussion what should we do thank you so much for subscribing my channel so jay bharat i wish you all the best I wish you all the best. Thank you.